Imagine you're standing in front of a massive 1,000 piece jigsaw puzzle. You might feel overwhelmed, right? I certainly did when I was younger, but then I discovered a trick that made the whole process much easier. I started breaking the puzzle down into smaller sections, focusing on just the edges first, and then different sections of the puzzle. This approach transformed a daunting task into a manageable one. And this, my friends, is the essence of decomposition. Hello everyone. Today we're going to explore one of the most powerful skills in computational thinking, decomposition. Now decomposition involves breaking down a big problem or a complex system into smaller, more manageable parts. This makes understanding and solving the problem much easier. Think about decomposition like this. Imagine you're trying to eat a gigantic pizza. You wouldn't try to eat it all in one bite. Instead, you'd cut it into slices and tackle each piece by piece. And this is exactly what decomposition helps us to do with problems. By separating a big problem into smaller pieces, each piece can be tackled one at a time, making the whole problem much easier to solve. Decomposition isn't just useful for physical tasks. It's an incredibly powerful thing for cognitive challenges too. Let's take a look at an example from the tech world designing a video game. It sounds really, really complicated, but if we decompose this task, it becomes much more manageable. Here's how. You might start with storyline development, start by creating the main plot and perhaps who the characters are going to be. Then it might be on to level design, sketching out the different levels or environments where the game's going to take place. Then you might tackle the programming, writing code for player interactions, the game mechanics and the user interface. Then it might be on to arts and graphics, designing the characters, the backgrounds and the animations. Then you might come on to testing, play test the game to find any bugs and fix any issues that might come up. And then it might be the launch planning, so organising the release and the marketing of the game to ensure it reaches the audience that you want it for. By breaking down the task of designing a video game into these smaller steps, what once seemed impossible now feels achievable. Breaking down problems through decomposition has several key benefits. It makes a problem seem less daunting, just like tackling the edge pieces of a jigsaw puzzle first. It helps identify which parts of the problem are more critical or require more focus. You can see where you need to spend more time and more effort. It makes it easier to allocate tasks among, among several people. Imagine trying to make a video game all by yourself. Decomposition allows a team to work on different parts simultaneously, making the process much more efficient. So the next time you're faced with a big challenge, remember the power of decomposition. Whether you're planning an event, working on a school project, or even just cleaning your room, breaking down the task into smaller, more manageable parts can make a huge difference. By thinking of decomposition as the first step in tackling any difficult task or project, you'll find that nothing is too big to handle. Just like that 1000 piece jigsaw, with the right approach, any problem can be solved one piece at a time.